Ladies and gentlemen, SoCal Pro Wrestling Super Clash is just around the corner, September 18th, 2010, in Oceanside, California, at the Oceanside Boys and Girls Club. Just signed, Johnny Paradise taking on SoCal Crazy. Let's hear from SoCal Crazy. Johnny Paradise. Oh, my God. You again. You came? I, I honestly thought that you were out of SoCal Pro. When I beat you for the AWS title, I thought that was it. You did get it back. Fine, no problem. I can live with that. Life goes on. But now you come back to SoCal Pro, and not only that, but cost me the number one contenders match. All right, Paradise. I'll play your little game this time. I will see you September 18th. Well, SoCal Crazy, very confident going into that matchup in what should be an epic encounter at the Oceanside Boys and Girls Club. Now, also in action, we will see six-man tag team action as Tommy Wilson teams with Rick Ellis and Peter Avalon to battle it out with the Rock Nest Monsters and their partner, Jason Redondo. Let's hear from one half of the Rock Nest Monsters, Johnny Yuma. What's up, all you SoCal Pro fans? Johnny Yuma here, one half of the SoCal Pro Tag Team Champions, the Rock Nest Monsters. And Good Time and I, we're teaming with a foe turned friend in Jason Redondo as we take on Rick Ellis, Peter Avalon, and Mr. Megastar, Tommy Wilson. Super Clash is going to be a huge show, and we're going to have a huge six-man tag, and I'm pretty sure us three are going to be able to take care of them, no problem. Hope you guys are ready to rock, baby, because Rockness and Redondo are always ready to roll. Now, the Rock Nets monsters have been rocking and rolling all over the National Wrestling Alliance, but let's hear what two of their opponents have to say, Tommy Wilson and Peter Avalon. SoCal Pro, September 18th, baby. Are you ready? I'm ready. A big three-on-three three tag match. Me, my partner, Rick Ellis, and this man, Tommy Wilson. Now, Peter, you know I'm ready because I'm always ready. Yeah. And when we get the Rockness Monsters and Redondo in the ring, good times ribs are going to break. Oh. Oh. Yuma's head's going to roll. Ooh. And old man Redondo, I'm going to stomp him until he's done for. It's going to be Tommy Wilson's night. That's right, baby. Now, ladies and gentlemen, in addition to those two big matches, we will also see the newly arrogant, newly, uh, you could say, obnoxious Nick Lovin taking on Kid Karumba. Let's hear from Mr. Lovin. Super Clash, Saturday, September 18th. Kid Karumba, you may think you look good on these SoCal Pro advertisements, but when I'm done beating your face in, no amount of Photoshopping is going to make you look good. Not at all. So I hope you're ready, baby, because I'm coming for you. Now, ladies and gentlemen, Nick Lovin, seemingly confident as ever and highly obnoxious. And moving on to some other matches, we will also see Angel Santos take on Ariel Stars. Should prove to be a very interesting contest. Now. Moving on from all of this, we've already named four big matches. Let's talk about our double main event. It will be the NWA World's heavyweight title on the line as Adam Pearce defends that title against Chimera. Chimera has been on an incredible winning streak for months and months and months, and you gotta wonder, will Chimera be the guy to wrestle away the NWA title from the Scrap Daddy? Now, of course, the match that everybody's been waiting for, you could say we've been waiting for over a year now. Back at Super Clash 2009, Ricky Mandel turned his back on his tag team partner, Hector Canales. Since then, Mandel won the SoCal Pro title and has been dodging and ducking Canales every chance he gets. Well, the dodging and the ducking ends at Super Clash 2010 when Ricky Mandel will finally defend that title against Hector Canales. Ladies and gentlemen, make sure you come on down and check out Super Clash 2010, September 18th at the Oceanside Boys and Girls Club in Oceanside, California. We will see you there.